السلام عليكم in this video I will show you how can you insert technical data for any element in your single line diagram okay to successfully insert technical data please start with all sources first okay the first step insert data for any source in your single line diagram so I will start with this power grid then I will insert the data to this generator then the second step insert data for all transformers in your single line diagram then insert data for loads breakers cables transmission line capacitors and so on okay so the first step please double left click here and you can find this interface this interface contains more than one menu info rating short circuit time domain and so on from info please insert the name of this power grid i will give name to this grid with power grid okay then from connection you can toggle between three phase or single phase but before connection okay so if you delete this connection you can select the connection type three phase or single phase okay okay so if you want to select single phase please before connection select single phase okay from uh, operation mode select swing then from rating insert the rate kilovolt of this power grid in this example the rate kilovolt is 115 kilo so insert here 115 okay the uh, value of uh, voltage or the unit of voltage here is kilo volt from short circuit insert the value of megavolt and bear short circuit in case of three phase fault and single phase fault single phase fault means line to ground fault so the value in case of three phase fault will be two thousand megavolt and virtual circuit and four line to ground will be one seven five zero the value of ratio of x divided by r in case of three phase equal 55 and in case of line to ground equal 48 okay okay then okay the second step i will insert the data for this generator okay the name of this generator is generator 3 and the operation mode is voltage control select voltage control to control the volt and you can also take fixed power from it voltage control means fixed megawatt okay from here from rating insert the uh, megawatt of this transformer is 25 and the rate kilovolt of this transformer is 13.8 okay and from here insert the uh, power that you will take it from this generator in this example i will take uh, only four mega okay and from mega var limit select user defined and select q maximum 10 okay and from impedance select typical data then okay okay then i will insert data for this transformer this transformer from rating the primary kilovolt is 115 and the secondary is 13.8 and megavolt ampere of this transformer is 20 and from impedance select typical z and x divided by r okay then double left click on this transformer three winding transformer from rating the tertiary side equals 13.8 and the megavolt ampere of the primary is 30 and of secondary is 20 and for tertiary is 15 okay from impedance please insert the value of 
uh, impedance between primary and secondary, primary and tertiary, secondary and tertiary. Okay, so insert here impedance value 7.5 and here 7.5 and here 14.5 then the ratio x divided by r will be 12 12 and 12 okay okay then double left click on this lump load and from nameplate from calculator the value of this load is 8 mega then select uh, fixed mega volt ampere insert here 8 mega volt ampere and bar factor would be 90 okay substitute okay okay the value of this lumped load is 18 mega volt ampere then double left click here from Numbered from calculator, select fixed megavolt ampere, insert 18 megavolt ampere from power factor, insert the value of power factor 90, then substitute. Okay, okay. Now I finished insert all technical data for all AC elements in this single line diagram except this load then the value of this load is 10 megavolt ampere then from loading from calculator insert here 10 megavolt ampere power factor select from here first fixed megavolt ampere this static load so the power factor will be 100 okay then substitute okay now i finished insert all technical data for all ac elements in this single line diagram Thank you.